Hello, welcome back to Yakuza. It's June 26th, and guess what? Glenner got and, uh, suspended from Twitter. Hooray. Hey, Kazuma. Take a look at this. Oh, nice. This, Took me a second to process who you said. <laughs> I thought you said glitter. I was like, What's glitter? Huh? That, I like glitter. This huh? morning we found this corpse. Told How me would I be that. happy about them getting banned? This tattoo. They did fan art for us, but no, you meant the, <laughs> the bad man who pretended he could write a TV show the and convinced death people that he could write blood, TV shows. Force trauma to the head. <laughs> Body was weighed down with cinder blocks. Anyways, some thing. serious shit is happening, so I don't know why we're being. Is it Mizuki? Goofballs? I can't say for sure, but the tattoo isn't it the same as the one Mizuki has? I mean, maybe, Looks but like first I should ask every up. single person in town if they've seen this tattoo. Around here. Looks like the character for Uta, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. That means it's the work of Utabori II, the master tattoo artist. He always leaves a signature somewhere on his pieces. <laughs> so you're saying this corpse was tattooed by probably this more practical yeah, I had my back Japanese, by given yeah, the way you should bear off that work. You can just put a somewhere between Sanrio Avenue fine. and Pink Street. Mm -hmm. If the woman in the picture is in fact Mizuki, we must never Maybe tell how. You can definitely do like uh, yeah, single letter signatures or two letter signatures. I'm gonna step out for a bit. Be careful. It's more just like, I don't know how common that actually is. Signing a tattoo, I feel like. <sighs> Some people. Ah, what a delightful key item. Yep. Hey. Hey. Alright, well, we'll do. Let's just explore town with this picture of a corpse in our pocket. So, thankfully, we do have specific directions. We gotta go to that tattoo artist. But first, this is a Yakuza game, so guess what? And it's a new chapter. Side stories. Oh, heck, it's the Burger King leader. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this guy. <laughs> Yeah, when I first played, I somehow forgot that B King was the um oh the gang that Takashi joined and tried to leave via text message, <laughs> even though it was literally last chapter. I mean, I didn't realize they were B King, you know, in the last chapter. So. <laughs> I guess they said because there was only one fight and nobody said the phrase B King out loud. It was just. Uh, on the intro splash page, but hey, remember how uh, interesting that guy's fight was? Hell now yeah. his move set is is on our side. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Unfortunately, it's got the one, so no dual heat action. God, I we can don't get to do the we don't get to do the heavens tornado from Kamen Rider Double. Dang. Okay, is this side quest in Kiwami? I don't know. God, I really Even if it is, I highly doubt that the, uh, they have a special heat action for this character. Because Yakuza 0 had a generic cool heat action. Yeah, they have a very distinct uh, dual heat action. Also, travel really far for that fight. Mm hmm. I thought it would help. Clearly, it hasn't. Nope. It's, it's three dodgy guys. So I've said I do not like fighting the dodgy men. Hold on a sec, let me Google something. How many guys can one guy take on at once? <laughs> also, if you look at the map, it suddenly moves a lot. Uh, that's because I'm trying to rotate the camera, which you can't do in Yakuza 1. You just have a shoulder button for resetting the camera. I really hope Beeking is willing to <laughs> take all these guys down. 
<laughs> Damn. I don't even know how that happened. God, now I'm kind of rooting for these guys, to be honest. They've got the moves. Hold on, gotta chug an energy drink. I only need one X. Hold on, I gotta stamina. chug two energy drinks. I need two X's, but separately. <laughs> So you said this game has no dual heat actions, but I don't know, these guys seem like they're acting pretty good. <laughs> Anyways, that one hit I got in managed to knock that guy out. Oh jeez. Let out really Thanks, bad King. Nice. I didn't even do it. V King got the last blow. Fucking got him with like the last frame of that headbutt. as you can get. <laughs> Alright, thankfully, for now at least, it's the only side story we gotta worry about. Excuse me, sir, can you help me deal with Waluigi? <laughs> I don't like that I can still see the green arrow. <laughs> Indicating that I'm supposed to talk to that man. I'm still coming for you, Kiryu. Long time no Every see. copy of Yakuza 1 is personalized, <laughs> Kiryu. Kazuma. Yeah. I got released from prison a few days ago. In time to... A uh, few days, you say. ...at Sera's funeral. <laughs> so... I mean, that was several get side quests ago. Retouched? Who no. even... Who even remembers that? The authorities... <laughs> it's the queen of the night. A flower that only blooms once I know a year. one cop, and he likes me, so I Actually, assume that means they all like me. This tattoo? You think I did this one? Hmm. This looks like my signature. A lot of people have been imitating me. I remember all the tattoos I design. This isn't my work. I see. Look at that. No attention in detail. It sucks. Hello. Ah, it's you. Yeah, he's here. It's Nishki. What? Yeah? It's been a long time, brother. How did you know I was here? When you have power, the information you need simply finds you. Well, Luigi taught me everything I needed to know. <laughs> Have you seen Mizuki's body yet? What the? I'd like to talk to you in private. Tomorrow, 10 p.m. at Serena. Kazuma. I'm not even gonna reply to that. I'll retouch your dragon tattoo. With a weak dragon on your back, there's no way you'll defeat Mizuki. <laughs> You've got a power up, Kiryu. It's been more than ten years since I inked this dragon, and Nishiki got the carp tattooed on his back. A tattoo is greatly influenced by the person who has it. The carp on Nishiki's back must be shining quite vigorously with color these days. With it, he's now a challenge for you, maybe your equal. The carp in the Yellow River swims upstream, passes the mountain range, and finally reaches the caverns at Longmin, yeah, where yeah, it will be reborn as a dragon. Nishki is about to reach about Longmin, this, this but before becoming a dragon, he'll need to confront an adversary, an adversary such as yourself. Trust me, he's very powerful. He's deep into these metaphors. <laughs> Gives him strength. Reaches level 20, you're fucked. Baby. Well, 
thankfully, he doesn't go around doing side quests, I assume. So he can't just <laughs> go around and say, hmm, I'm about to level up, and that side quest looks like just enough experience. <laughs> so you'll have to learn Thunder Punch. You'll become a dragon, but you'll have a quad weakness to it. I love walking past the Don Quixote shops because it's just. You get a couple snippets of that song. It's otherwise a very musicless walk. Gamers, I take the stairs because I'm a pro like that. Mm -hmm. Actually, pass here if you take the little screen into account. Nishki is coming here. Yeah, but the Tojo clan is after Haruka. We've got to hide her. Purgatory would be the safest bet. It's just hide a that child place, in purgatory. It's fine. It is safe, but I won't go. I won't. What's the matter, Haruka? I'm morally Mister, opposed to that whole spying to operation they've got mother, going right? on. So then, <laughs> why didn't you take me with you? I... I want to see my mommy. I didn't come here to play. Haruka, listen. You want this, don't you? It's There's all anyone wants. No one cares about me, <laughs> do they? Mr... You just want that 10 billion yen, that's why you're with me! The fuck care you? I'm sorry. <laughs> and you can't do this twice in a row! You know something, You probably can you? do it once! Come on, say something! Say something, please! Haruka, listen. Your mother is- Shut the hell up. Don't you dare. <laughs> Haruka? <laughs> Amazing, you, you said that in a right single now. lip flap. That's all I can say. I want to trust you, but... I get the feeling that was one of the scenes where they let Kurilo see what if, the lip flaps were. If you're going to be went, that uh... way, then so will I. <laughs> I gotta say this in I'm one leaving. lip flap? Haruka, John. Haruka. Well, Kiri, that's probably your fault, so you handle this. Say Dante. Okay, so he's coming with us. Yeah, you can't talk to him because he's a he's a companion. Right? Well, that just ruins my joke. I was gonna be like, oh, Dante, why aren't you helping? But he is. Insofar as he's following the same path we are. <laughs> Otherwise, he's contributing nothing. All right, we need information, so let's go to the informant. You know, the, that the informant. Yeah, she went to Purgatory and trained with some old dudes, so and now she's super powerful. Mm -hmm. Ha! Sort of influence in her life. Oh. Wait, hold, hold on. How did. So she came here and then she went to the parking lot. And then you were also in the parking lot and happened to come here? I guess that could happen, but I feel Two like. ships in the night! <laughs> I feel like that normally how these sorts of things are written. It's like I heard that girl say he was going to the park on the parking lot of Shishikuku Street. Hey, 
Alright, keep up, Date. Date. My legs are Date, I don't think you really care about how. Oh my god. I catch up during screen loading. I can move around while you're paused, hear you. <laughs> hear you, I'm walking. I can't do this voice. Hear you, I'm walking, you need to stop trying. God damn it, Dante, stop minutes. that. <laughs> How's that a threat? There we go, see, now that's a threat. Mm -hmm. Sort of a weird thing where normally if you do the same thing twice in a game, and you get the same result, that means you gotta do something else. But this is the second time in Yakuza, we've had to do something three times. And now we know she's at a park. Three parks. She's just visiting all get of them. <laughs> she's got a little stamp book and she's gonna stamp them all. She's been meaning to do this for a while, but you know, that seems like a good opportunity. I get my ticket punched at all three. <laughs> At all three parks, I get a free scoop of ice cream. Too. All right. Well, we looked at the entrance, and she wasn't there. Yep. But now we know she's not anywhere in the park. Yeah, I mean, look at that passing glance; it revealed nothing. So you know. I, you know, I am thankful they don't make us look through the entire park. But like, there could have just been a guy out front. Hey, a little girl coming here? No, no, not all day. Look, it's not as though kids are masters at hiding or anything. They do not play any sort of games that would give them training in such an activity. They stick like out. They stick out like a sore thumb all day, every day. Well. Another park on Chichipuku Street, so let's go check it there. There's a park which isn't called Chichipuku Park, that's a parking lot. I've been over this before and I'm still upset about it. Uh, hopefully we can find her because people are just you know, disappearing and reappearing. Okay, the well. <laughs> Dante. Dante! You okay, buddy? You having trouble, bud? The third park, the only park that matters. That's what it says on the sign. Mm -hmm. There's only two parks in me, and I just visited the third. Where's Haruka? You must be Kazuma san and Detective Date. We've been preparing. Your Holy shit, that worked. Please, follow me. <laughs> I have to believe that Kiryu said that to every single person he's walked by. Where's this Harvard? is Stardust, right? What's going on here? You'll soon find out. God, this guy is just giving me similar vibes to uh, Goldman from House of the Dead, too. I've been waiting for you, Kazuma-san. If there's so much as a scratch on her... Haruka! Can't see any scratches, but I need a close look. Where's Kazuki and everyone else? They're in the other room. We had to tie them up. But they're alive. Who are you? It's better I don't tell you. For both our sakes. Anyhow... 
Where's the pendant this girl is supposed to be wearing? That pendant will unlock the seal on our dark god, and he may be at Hand it over. If I give this to you, you're gonna let Haruka go. I wish there was a Yakuza game like that. For just the last minute plot bust is, oh shit, this is actual, like, <laughs> final boss JRPG bullshit. Stop. Stop right there. I want you to throw the pendant to me right now. It's a pretty long distance. Haruka, I'm sorry. He's a pretty strong guy. Action, Date. <laughs> Here I go. Suplex the child. <laughs> to safety. Hey, Date, you all right? Yeah, but Haruka. Shit. It is indeed, but she got hit. Date, you fuck. <gasps> Damn it. I can't believe my suplex wasn't good enough. I get it in theory. Toss the pendant up high so they look up and they can't see Dante when he runs. But Shoot. there's two of them. Shoot. So the guy with the gun probably didn't look up. Damn, I wasn't counting on them being well trained. So that man without a gun has a very, like, striking design. Knock his ass out in one hit. And yeah, now he's voiced by you. Someone's totally different. Oh, hey, there they are. <laughs> Alright, I'm done. <laughs> so around this time, I noticed that thing in the upper right corner. It's been. It's been. Eventually. It's been. Come on. It is in this fight, I promise. I gotta spin to win. There we go, good. They <laughs> played, they played, let it rip. That didn't hit anyone, but okay. So yeah, the Knuckles item just let you do this. Jesus. And now we're down here. <laughs> and now I'm back on the stairs. Kicked the man so hard you just teleported to the bottom of the staircase. Ah, oh, jeez. It's the entire unknown alphabet. I'm gonna use ancient power on you. Mm -hmm. I'm not threatened at all. <laughs> oh my butt! Down I go. That man probably has a concussion. There they go. Which organization? Do you belong to? You're not Yakuza, are you? What do you know about the pendant? Hey, answer me. We were sent by J Jing. Ah! Fuck. <laughs> ah, heck. Invitro three, yeah, sound bite. Is Haruka okay? She's bleeding, but it's just a scratch. Don't worry, she'll be fine. Mister, you uh, came to rescue me. Yeah. I'm sorry. I, I was being selfish. You got shot, Haruka. You don't have to be about. To you don't have to be sorry to about anything for the rest of the day, if not the rest of the week. Very carefully. You're good, okay. Haruka. You're good. Mizuki, your mother. She's... she's dead. I'm sorry. Figured I'd help you get over the I, whole, you know, getting grazed by a bull thing her. by giving you that info. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so, so sorry. Haruka. It's what she wanted. Cavalry's here. Oh. Also, we're not tied up. 
The man that got shot we broke was wearing the ropes this badge. Because we're just that good. I'll take this and try and find out what's going on. All right, you do that. <laughs> Thankfully, one of our hosts was into that kind of stuff, so he knew how to untie himself. I apologize. I got you involved in this mess. What are you talking about? Please, there's no need to apologize. He's right. We should be the ones apologizing. We weren't able to do anything when they had their guns pointed at us. I'm sorry. Sorry for trying to not die when our lives were threatened. Oh. This must be that little girl. Yeah. <laughs> I think she's scared of me. Hey. Will you help this little girl out and let her stay here for a while? It's no problem. But I gotta say, I feel a little awkward doing you a favor. Yeah. Same here. <laughs> Make yourself at home. I don't like you, you don't I know like it's me, nothing to brag about, but it'll suffice. Kage. We Thank you. Beauty and the Beast and oh, Cinderella, but not the Little Mermaid. This. This oh, place I swear never pops, again in this house. Name it. Rest assured. Kazuma. I'm going to head back to the station. You're going to meet Nishiki tomorrow. Get some rest. Yeah. I will. That seems bad. Date. Sudo. What's a Section 4 detective doing here? This is a homicide scene, you know. You're right. I'll be on my way. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't notice. Ten years ago. I looked up to you. Precise investigations, attention to details, and a passion for solving each and every case. You were one hell of a detective. But look at you now. I can't make any sense of what you're trying to do. What are you trying to say? You know, I've been watching you and your partner. Take my words as a warning, sir. Pseudo, you'll never fully understand what's really going on. <laughs> 